Yo, what is up squad? It's your girl Sixshot. Thank you so much for stopping by and hanging out with me today. Is that a goat? <gasps> That's the first time I see the goat in this one in, in, in this world. We have to go check out the goat, but first, let's finish the intro. Thank you so much for stopping by and hanging out with me today for episode 8 of my Minecraft journey. Now, if you missed the last episode, our last hangout session, I should say, we went out and had to go scour the area for some bees. Uh, when we came back from our adventure, we realized that all of my bees have been gone. Have been gone? Have, have disappeared. Oh my god i swear i i know english sometimes but all of our bees were gone uh so i set off on a mission to go find some we repopulated the hive um i haven't uh done any more breeding since since you last saw so there's still like 50 something bees in there which is more than enough than what we need but you know there's still more homes for them if we want to repopulate a little bit more we could anyways we saw a goat just now i am going to go check it out before i tell you what i really wanted to do today i think it's cool i haven't seen a goat in I, honestly i forgot that they were new to 117 because i haven't seen them at all look at that like, I was doing the intro, and it- OH! Okay. I can't get up. Stop. Where'd you go? Hi! Oh, of course. Where were you when I needed you yesterday? Oh, hello? You too! Oh, what? <laughs> Is there more? Those those sheep. Hello. Is there another one of you guys around? More sheepies? Chicken? Oh, you're so cute. Do I have a lead? I think I do. Hold on. I do. Can they be put on a lead? Oh! Well, that was rude. Why do I hear a wolf too now? What? Doesn't matter, I'm taking you. Excuse me, sir. Can you come with me? You need to stop messing with the sheepies. Uh, no, you can't? Oh, yes, you can. We're gonna bring him back down here. Hopefully, that's not too bad. What happened to this tree? <laughs> okay. Well, since you like to headbutt things, you will be the protector of this here village. I'm gonna put you right over there. Oh, should I? They don't do- I'll put you with the horse. Right over here. I don't want you to headbutt my dog and then my dog... Right here. Boop. You're gonna stay here, Billy. That's gonna be your name. Billy. I'll get a name tag for you later, and I will name you. Don't go headbutting anything, unless it's a baddie, then go ah, then go ahead. Okay, anyways, <laughs> moving on. Now that that's out the way, I am going to work on this area here after I sleep. Okay. I'm gonna work on this area here. I like this part for the most part, I flattened it out because I didn't like this little hill coming down. It was, it's a river biome, I think. Yeah, river biome over here. And then it went back 
up and there's another hill right here and I didn't like going up and down and up and down into the swamp. I have a skelly spawn there somewhere that way and I hated like going up and down and up and down. Yes, I know I have elytra and I can fly, but it's much more immersive, right? If you just walk around. I started to rely way too much on the elytra at one point and it made it not fun. Like, cause then, like, if you notice, like, my world is not, like, I don't have pathways. I don't have, like, any, like, it doesn't flow any certain way. Like, it doesn't get you to walk in a certain direction or anything like that. It was because I had an elytra. And I was like, it doesn't matter what, what I can get from point A to point B when I fly. The in-between doesn't matter. But I really want to focus, like I've said before in many episodes, I want to focus on getting better. I want to learn how to build. I want to learn how to terraform. I want to, you know, learn how to beautify my world because I love this world. I I love, like, this world is my base. I could literally pick anywhere and build a, build something, build a little house. And I want to be able to do that. So I need to practice. That's what my Minecraft journey is all about. Learning redstone, learning how to build, learning how to make things or beautify things. There we go. That's a good way to say it, I think. That's what this journey is about because this world is not going anywhere. It doesn't matter if I start a, a new world, a new seed, a new series. It doesn't matter. This world will still always exist. Okay, serious moment. I stared. At, I stared deep into your, your your souls, way more than enough, right there. I think you get the point. <laughs> but for what I want to do right here, actually, is since I flattened it out with, I didn't really initially have a plan for it, but I want to make this area all crops. I'm gonna start off with wheat today, and then you know. When I when we expand and we make it branch out further, we can always add carrots, potatoes, beet, beet root, and anything else. But for now, I have this area all cleared out. Um, I also tried a little bit of terraforming, not too much over there. That was naturally generated. But around this area, I tried. I had to open it up so that you know crops could actually fit because I want it to be all down here. Uh, this is a river biome, and it naturally generated with no water in it. So, <laughs> uh, at first, I thought I wanted to put water in it because I should have my wings so that I can get places faster right now. Just to show you guys what I'm talking about. Because this is all river. See, that that's all the water that was in this river. But it comes along this way, and then this river here would come right up around my fortress. So, when I initially realized that, I was going to dig it all out and actually fill it with water. But, ow, I, I tapped that tree on accident. But, ah, uh -huh, fly, thank you, I'm Yeah, now I just have other plans. And I tried to make it so that there would be crops that would come down here. So this is all going to be wheat. I opened this up a little bit. I still don't know what I want to do with this part. I'm still working on the terraforming. If anything, if I change anything, I of course can expand it or anything like that. And I think I'm just going to have wheat coming right around this whole area. I got as far as the that little river or pond, whatever you want to call it, right on the other side of this hill. I don't think I have enough seeds for that, however. So all we're going to do today is uh, a lot of farming. I hope you guys are ready. Oh, you know, I said that and it totally, I thought I was ready. I totally thought I was ready. I really, really did. But just hearing those words come out of my mouth and then looking at this area, that, ah, it's going to take forever. Well, let's get to it then.
should be able to have like water right there I'm kind of trying to try but oh, wow trying to try to <laughs> I'm kind of just gonna put the water in random places and then we could just hoe a bunch of areas and see where it doesn't retain water. And if it doesn't retain water, then it'll turn back into a dirt block. Like that. And then we know where we need to put a new water source. From there. Um, but, one, it's turning nighttime. I have to sleep. And two, I forgot... To bring some spruce slabs so that I can cover up the water. So I will be back in a second. Alright, so let's see. So these are turning back to dirt. So we're just going to count four from that block. One, two, three, four. And on the fifth block. Oh, let's count from this way too. One, two, three, four. So the fifth block. That's where I want to put my water. And then we're just going to do the same thing. Oh man, and then you think about, I got to do it all the way to over there. I don't think we're going to even have enough seeds. Oh, let me finish this area. Alright, so I am going to grab some seeds. Well, I'm going to fill my water bucket for now. I don't think I have that much seeds, but let's see. Now the fun part! Oh god. gonna be a long project isn't it wow all right well i'll do along this water area over here one two three four only because i have some seeds left now i can go four that way four this way Let's see, that might be all the seeds I have enough for right now. I'm sure I can go find, oh, more seeds somewhere else. But this is going to be an ongoing project. It is going to require a lot of farming and a lot of seeds. So, so I will definitely have to do a lot of grinding to get more seeds. Um, which probably means I will need to harvest my wheat field down over yonder. Which I've been avoiding. <laughs> but that'll get us a lot of seeds and I should be able to finish up this area. And uh, figure out where I want to implement some carrots and beetroot and potatoes and whatnot. But that's going to be it for this crop field area slash crop river that I got going on here. I want to figure out a spot on the top of the hills, though. Let me just gather up. Well, actually, I'll leave my things. Actually, no, I won't. <laughs> I'll bring this. Let me gather my things really quickly. 
and then let's get up here okay so what i was thinking i might flatten this out a little bit but what i want is i think maybe have this area be all sugar cane up on the top i think maybe possibly so maybe i'll flatten it down to here i don't know well let me just flatten it down i'll pick a level that i will stop at and then i wait should it go over there or over here i mean over here or over there i don't know well i'll pick a hill and then i will bring it down a few levels and then once i get it to where i think i want it to be i will bring you guys right back All right, squad, <laughs> I have flattened the area out. I am all good and ready to start filling in or figuring out, I should say, where I want to fill spots with water before I can plant my sugarcane. And this, these slabs here, they're just a placeholder for now because I'm thinking about creating a bridge here that'll go across that way. And I just wanted to uh, remember that because I have to keep in mind that I would need a path along this side. Here is my infinite water source for now and the very first block that I started with because I don't know why I just started with it. And I think if I have this right, I don't know, I tried to... Uh, attempt to make this clip like 50,000 times if I'm gonna be honest but I kept messing up the water so I'd have to fill it in anyways because I kept doing it wrong and try to figure out the right way I think my water needs to go from so this is the first water source so from this it has to go two over and one up that would be a water source and then so from and i'm pretty sure it's like that in like all directions so like if i started here it would be two and one two and one and then two and one like that but that's into well maybe i don't know we'll we'll figure it out but um, so basically, I'm just going to go in this diagonal and do that. I'm going to work in the diagonal because I feel like it, it'll be easier that way. And I am just going to get all of these dug out. One, two, and one over. One, two, one. Okay, but all we have to really do is that a lot of times <laughs> so one two one one two and then over one two over one two over one just like oh, why didn't i think of saying it like that to you guys earlier i'm so i made it so complicated earlier okay cool and we're just gonna keep uh continuing with this uh, diagonal pattern until i guess until we We are done filling out the whole area. All right, squad, I finally got the water all, or I got the water pattern hopefully correct. But I think I got the pattern right. I hope I did. Otherwise, I just did that whole thing for nothing. But it should be so that I'll be able to put, yeah, pretty much like this. I'd be, oh, wait, I don't want that over there because this is going to be a walkway. So it's going to come all along this way. It should be able to put... Pretty much like that. I should be able to put um, sugar cane throughout the whole thing. There should not be... Except right there. And, and there. But that's because it's like so close to the edge. It has to come to a, a stopping point at some point. But now all I'm going to do is take my sugar cane... And wow, I think I need weight. That was a stack. I only brought like two stacks. 
Um, I only. <laughs> wow. Okay, I'm gonna need way more sugar cane, but I think it's looking nice. This is basically what I was going for. I didn't want any quote unquote dead spots where I can't plant. Um, oh darn, can't plant the sugar cane except for along this edge, of course, because it has to stop and and over here. I want my path to come down this way. I'm not sure where it's gonna go to yet, but I want a bridge that goes across over here so that's why i'm going to leave this area clear for now until i figure out a path i also don't really know if i want to keep this river area this dried up river whatever you want to call it um if i want to keep it looking like this or do i want to shape it better and like make it like have a wall like a stone brick wall or something i'm not sure not sure. Those are ideas that keep coming to me as I'm working on this project, though. But again, as you can see, it's going to need a whole lot of sugar canes. So I'm going to have to get more because two stacks only did not much, <laughs> not even half. Uh, but let's go right along this way and let's see how my wheat field is coming along yeah, it's looking pretty good but i haven't added anything to it just yet but just when all of this becomes a wheat field it's gonna look so nice i think i'll have this whole section be wheat and then maybe right when it comes to right in here i'll change over to something else and it'll flow all the way through with like, I don't know, carrots, maybe. I'm not really sure. Where am I going? Sugar cane. I'm gonna go get some sugar cane. I don't think I've... Well, first of all, I've never given you a tour of my world because... Uh, I, I just attempted to fly. Oh my god. I haven't had my wings on in so many episodes and I still do that all the time. I don't really know why I didn't give you a world tour. Maybe I'll do a small little world tour thing on like episode 10. Because I feel like that would be weird to do on episode 9. Um, oh wow. And I don't know why this... It's super small. Look at how small it is. And it like... It just pumps all that sugar cane right out. And I don't know why only the top one gets filled with some stuff sometimes. Uh, anyways, let's get back over there. I guess I never really did a tour on the first episode because I wasn't really sure. But well, I had already planned out what I wanted to do, honestly. I'm not, and and I wasn't really, I wasn't really good at talking and playing at the same time. I know that sounds really weird, but it's very uncomfortable at first. And I know I I've only done like you know, so many episodes, so it's not like I should be talking or anything like that. I'm like, nowhere near professional, but it really does, it, it really does take practice. <laughs> but it's, like, it's chill. I just like to play Minecraft, and I like to chill with you guys, and hopefully you guys enjoy hanging out with me as well. I can't see. I can't do it that way. It has to be sideways. I thought I was doing it weird, and I was gonna go this way, but then that gets in the way, see? And then you have to be like here in order to plant it every time. It just, just has a better flow for me if I do it this way. Whoop. I don't know about, about you guys, so you, let me know what works for you guys. <laughs> you guys pro <laughs> honestly, most people probably just make automated sugarcane farms and then leave it at that and i'm over here like let's plant a whole hilltop full of sugarcane why am i the way i am i don't know it's getting all weird now with all these like empty spaces because it's getting towards the end like right there can't put one but i can put one right there and that's about it sweet 
Now this time I brought way too much sugar cane. Wow, imagine harvesting this when it gets like full. I really want to shape this though. So that I can bring this out more closer. But we'll see. That could be a project for the future. Uh, I might not want to. I, I go through these phases. Sometimes I want everything to look as natural as possible. And it's, sometimes I want to be like, yeah, I want it to look like, you know, like someone came through here and like completely messed it up. <laughs> uh, but I guess it just depends on like what I'm feeling. But for right here, I really want a bridge that goes across over there. And I really think that that sugarcane has to go because I think, oh, <laughs> what I was going to say is I think an oak log is going to, uh, that's not even oak. Don't listen to me. Sometimes I, don't, I say not smart things. I meant spruce. I had to think about what I meant. What did I, I was like, what, what did I mean? Huh. <sighs> okay. So now that that's all situated. Mm, do I want it lifted or do I just want it level? That's another question. Honestly, this level is Y73. Yeah, and I believe that side is also Y73. I, un unless I did that wrong. Looked at the wrong thing. Yeah. It is Y73. I, I was going to say, I tried to make sure that the Y level was the same, but I thought, I doubted myself. <clears throat> so I think what would be smarter is, be smarter is, we'll take this down one because it's actually going to go right here. Don't you just love how I just took my shovel off my hot bar and then I need the shovel? Of course. It would be like more like right here. Yeah, probably. But I th also think I'm not going to use slabs. I think I want to use planks. Hmm. Yeah, I want to use planks. It's also almost nighttime. And you know what that means. It's time to get stuck on the hillside. <laughs> it's time to sleep. Take your bed with you, hello. Okay. So... What did I say I wanted? Spruce planks. Planks, right? Yeah, 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 planks. <laughs> um, let me get rid of this sugar cane for now. I have some dirt blocks I can put away. And... More spruce. And let's head back over there. What is your guys' favorite wood type to build with? Mine says definitely spruce. I love building with spruce. Um, spruce and dark oak have been... I used to do a lot of spruce and oak. Uh, but then recently, I've really started to enjoy dark oak logs with, like, spruce variants. Probably just me, but that's okay. What is happening, bro? Okay. We're almost there. Let's just build across because this is so much faster. And then perfect. Except that. Bam. Awesome. Then we need to grab some of this. One here, one here. I guess that can go right there. I 
kind of want it over there, but then that one is going to have to go all the way over there. I don't want this here anymore. I changed my mind. It's going to go right here. Boom. Boom. Right there. That's where I want it to be. Yep, that's where I want it. Right there. So we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So we could go 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 1. 1, 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. But do we want it straight down in the middle? See, that's the thing. I don't think I want it in the middle. 1, 2, 3, 4... And then five. Let me see what this looks like on this side. One, two, three, four, five. Is that what I did, or did I do five and then place it? One, two, three, four. No. If I did it like that, there would be a larger gap in the center, but at least these pillars would go down into the side of the mountain. If that makes sense. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven in the middle. I could go one, two, three, four, five, and then place it like right here. And then let's see what it looks like on this side. One, two, three, four, five, and then place it. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, there we go. Okay, that'll look pretty interesting. Look at that. It's starting to grow already, guys. Everything is flourishing. All right, squad, I believe that is going to be it for today's video. I think that's all the time we have for today. I really, really, really do appreciate you stopping by to hang out with me today, as always. And I hope you had fun. I had a whole lot of fun as well. Uh, here's our sugar cane. It's like taller than me, but that's not helpful. I'm really short. I'm short in real life. <laughs> Uh, but I'm so glad we got this going. It looks super good, too. Look at it. It looks super nice. Maybe we'll do another one. Or maybe that other hill that I thought about putting the sugar cane, we'll do bamboo or something. And then our uh, wheat is doing amazing as well. Um, I, as I harvest and I get more seeds, I will expand the wheat over time. I'm thinking about maybe just letting the wheat come to like about here, somewhere around this area, and it'll transition to either carrots or potatoes and make its way down throughout the river. Um, but yeah, this this is nice. It's super nice. I saw a skelly. I should sleep. Cool. Everything looks so good. And then um, I was getting irritated on... Uh, having to run down and run back up to get to the other side so this is the start of a bridge all i did is spruce planks going right across and then i'm gonna use spruce maybe should i try dark oak i might try dark oak but right now all i have is spruce as markers to where the uh, pillars are gonna go um i didn't really get to it all that much we could work on it on the next episode or maybe i'll work on it in between episodes i'm not really sure but again thank you guys so much for watching i hope to see you around more often to hang out with me especially if you had fun uh, i definitely had a whole lot of fun and that's all i got for you guys today it's been your girl six shot i hope you have an excellent rest of your day and i'll catch you guys in the next video deuces oh i'm so glad i didn't stop recording i forgot guys let's uh where are we we're over there something i forgot to do before you guys go that's oh, oh yeah that's the wheat field right there perfect wheat field is updated map is updated with sugarcane wait where's my bridge oh there it is and there's the bridge. I didn't even see it. Oh, and the top part of the sugarcane farm. Did I say sugarcane on the other one or did I say wheat? I don't even know if I said it right. Hopefully I did. But there's the maps, the two maps updated that shows our wheat field, sugarcane area, and the newly 
built bridge which is not finished but again we can always finish that in the next episode or maybe i'll do it in between episodes we'll see bye for real this time bye bye